So I work for Engineers Without Borders. We're a not-for-profit that works in humanitarian engineering and community development. Um, my role in the organisation is working with students, academics and professionals here in Australia and connecting them to our humanitarian work in the field. So my AsiaLink Workplace project very much aligns with the work that I do at Engineers Without Borders. So my project is to start the Asian Humanitarian Design Summit, which will be a two-week forum being held in Cambodia next year. Um, my plan is to take 40 young Australians from universities across the nation and give them a really immersive educational experience and the chance to work with their counterparts from Southeast Asia. So what we do is we aspire to get um, young Australians more connected to their neighbours to the north, as well as looking how they can apply their practical skills to support, engage and learn from communities overseas. I've had an amazing time in the Asia Link Leaders Program um, and I think being able to come from the not-for-profit sector has been really valuable. Um, for me it's been able to expand my networks to meet and work quite closely with people from government, from industry, from business and I would urge anyone from the not-for-profit sector to really consider this program. Um, it's broadened my horizons and I'm sure that there's a lot of people doing great work in community organisations around Australia that will get a lot out of this program.